now. Amadeus going up against my boy, Stroger. Yeah, I got a chance to spend a lot of time with Amadeus this weekend, man. He just kind of told me his background, where he comes from in Smash. Yep. And apparently, he's right in my backyard, man. He's a Midwest native as well, too, man. He is. He's out here on the SoCal coast, man, trying to put on some good work, man. And honestly, I, after playing friendlies with him, I'm very impressed. Yes. Very impressed from what I've seen. Okay. Yeah, very strong stake, man. As you see right here, he's moving and grooving. Certainly setting up shop here the right way. Okay, smart stuff. The media switch right into the persona. I love it, man. I seen out to play. And of course, my boy Shorter going with the Mr. Never See It coming in. So oh. big thank oh you to Porsche Nine that Five Ooh. One for the donation. Oh, the duck. Yeah, of course. Oh, and Wormsy. Rinse and repeat. What you gonna do? Oh, yeah. You never want to get hit by that hypno smash, man. Beautiful F tilt. Gets him on the side of the stage. The chase. Smart man. Safe bear. I love okay. the attempt for the frame trap not going to work out, though. Yeah, smart stuff. You know, you're never really too safe on these stages. The fact that Snake can up tilt through these platforms, man, makes the task at hand that much harder when it comes to landing. You know what I mean? And as you see right now, he has a lead here, and he's holding holding on to it, excuse me, the right way. Setting up shot here on the left side of stage. Has the C4. Has stage positional advantage right there. Smart stuff with the Nikita fake out. Yeah. So the thing is, even though right now we're looking at it, it seems like there's kind of a, quite a bit of a deficit. Uh -huh. Ultimately, Joker does... He really remarkably well in this matchup. Uh, in terms of the nades themselves, he's able to get essentially like a full uh, bar on his rebellion guard, so a rebellion gauge. So that's something that's really, really important. So you can get our scenes basically at will competing against Snake because of how the nades are and how they will interact. Yes. And so you can get killed. Also, even when he's not, uh, when he's in his normal form, because he's able to just go out there and edge guard Snake with Bear, he's usually in a good position to get a kill regardless of our scene is out or not. So. It's a very in intriguing matchup. I'm interested to see the development of it, but uh, just from what the simple things that I have seen, I feel that Joker doesn't do too bad. No, absolutely not. I think you know the general consensus thinks that. Uh, Ooh, oh my goodness! It don't matter what, what the general consensus. What are you consensus. trying to do? Yeah, it don't even matter what you think at that point, man. Wonderful edge guard right there. Oh my man, Amadeus, the back here into the stage spike, man. That was some messed up stuff. Yeah, man. Hit but, him with the sleeping bag. Yeah, right. policeman. <laughs> right, but you know, at, at lower percent, I think everybody thinks that this character is kind of like cheap. You know, obviously. Very combo uh, orientated, really, yep. really good at getting in, staying in for long periods of time. Then, of course, when uh, you know Persona's online, things get a little bit more dangerous for the competition. Oh, okay, hold on, real quick. Shout out to Wait. Brian underscore F, man. Donated ten dollars, man. We're on the oh, up, Bri like yo, this. Brian F, yo. Shout out to Brian F, That's yo. Right. He, he's actually know. a real one. The goat. <laughs> he's, a, he's a boxer, man. Mm -hmm. Rock life. Okay, once more. Another Nikita tried to eat it. Of course, he only Ooh, ate it a fourth. Oh, oh, come on now. He wanted the coup de gras. He's going to be okay, too. He's not going to suffer too much from it, but he's going to be thrown off stage. Let's see what's going to happen here. Because this is... Oh. So I think that uh, because it decayed, it actually didn't interrupt uh, up being anymore. So right. that was actually a pretty funny situation. Okay, he has to tether back to stage. A little misposition with the up tilt. I do like that. It was his position uh, backwards right there. So, of course, he wasn't able to find that opening. And once more, man, Stroder just putting on this low percent. Oh, damage. and I love it Lucas. so much. From Luke. Linden, man. From Linden. Linden. Donating $10. We appreciate the love, bro. Always. Always. Let's keep that coming here, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, let's oh. move. Can we get a sub train? Oh, oh yeah. All right. This is what I'm talking about right here, man. Slow and steady is certainly going to win the race. You know, it's, it's very easy to feel like you're in a, a rushing state of mind when you play against a character like Snake because True. he can be annoying to fight against. Just because he puts up that wall, yeah. just, and it really becomes frustrating on trying to get in. But you really got to stick to your guns. No puns intended. Absolutely. So you got oh, the game and that's hand. easy. Peasy, man. That up tilt is going to take your life. It's a little bit above 100, man. You always got to respect that move. Such a devastating tool mm -hmm. in Snake's repertoire, hailing from Brawl. Best believe. Doesn't matter if that hitbox got nerfed. You still need to respect the sheer kill power oh, yeah. of that move. One of the uh, strongest, if not the strongest, depending on who you ask, and here in the game. The fact that you can use up to and just stuff out all your jump in options, especially somebody like Joker who gets a lot off of like the short hop aerial animations. You know, like a lot of those, you know, kind of convert into bigger damage for him. But yep. right now, Stroder is switching off from the Joker. We're actually going to. Uh, Pick up the Mario here, and I actually I'm, I'm a little appreciative of Mario here in this matchup. You know, I mean Snake has a hard time as it is off stage. Um, uh, Mario, depending on how he's played, can obviously get out there, really stick it to Snake. True. And then using things like Blood to just constantly reposition Snake while he's on that cipher, man, can really be a thorn in his side. Wait a minute. Okay. One of the things I'm seeing right now from Amadeus is he has been 
incredibly, incredibly mobile with the snake. And I think that's really, really important in this matchup. Because again, you, when you're looking at a uh, child static, the donation for the $5, I love it. it. One thing about Snake in general is when you're being mobile, he's still, even when his hitbox has got nerfed, his general hitboxes are still fairly large size. Oh yeah. Especially for versus a character like Mario, who's going to have a lot more stubby normals overall. So he's still going to have a hard time going in. And of course, with those traps, too, having to navigate all those things, even with the arrow mobility, it's going to be rough. Yeah. Oh, oh my oh, goodness. You see how far away that up tilt hit, man? All right. What the heck? Okay, back up. Give me a little bit of space to work with here, using that forward tilt. And I'm loving this, man. Again, setting up shot, making it so hard for Stroger to get in. But see, this is what oh makes my Mario gosh. so Yo, give dangerous. me your coins, man. Coins. I hope you donate those coins, Mario. That's you need right. to calm down with those, that. Those are Chuck E. Cheese tokens right there, man. This is what makes Mario so dangerous. The fact that he can just relentlessly chase Snake down, man. Yep. Okay, once more, another Nikita. Gets back yep, to Legend. Set up. Oh, my play. God. Good catch. That is one thing that he will have. Uh, Snake is a character who is incredible hmm. at edge guarding. Uh-oh, get locked up, oh, Akon. Set they won't let me out. Where are we going? Oh, they're going to sit back down. Go back to neutral, going down throw. Oh, easy F till reversal. That was a, just a perfect percent for him to actually land on that platform and still be in the frame advantage. So, very, very fortunate right. for Amadeus. But very, very skilled for him to actually recognize that situation. Most definitely, man. You know, his situational awareness just throughout the majority of this set has been actually pretty uh, pretty nasty. But I'm actually surprised that he was able to almost finish that combo. And that's the, that's the great thing about Pokemon Stadium. Like, you have the ability to uh, extend combos off of these platforms. But they can also mess up combos as well, too. Like, the stage, it gives, but it also takes a lot as well. Yes. All right, make Oh, space time with the twenty dollars. Thank you so much. Right. The love. We are moving. Yeah, man. we most definitely are. Man, I don't know what it is, man. Maybe all the high rollers are just awake right now. All right. I, I feel like they just woke up and said, "What? You got a cause? All right, man. We, uh, let's fight for it. That's right. Whatever it takes. Whatever baby. it takes. Whatever it takes. Okay. Has to see four setups. He's gonna have to be mindful about the left side of the stage, too, especially as you try to land on the. The platforms are like a position away from the platform. It's very Absolutely. comfortable. You, know, you don't want to get blown up. Yep. Oh, my God. Oh, oh he's okay. getting smooth on him. Yeah. He's getting smooth. Yeah, I, I like it. I like it. Okay. The Does weight. Huh? Okay, smart stuff there. Not doing anything off this wall. Wow. <laughs> I need to get to that anyway. But you know, you know <laughs> what I like, though? I like, I like that server. I like that he said, you know what? I'm not afraid. Sometimes you got to let your opponent know. Oh, yeah. Cash out on him. Take that bank account. Oh, you said run it back. I see. I knew Mario was going to be the right pick. Am I saying that I don't trust in anybody's joke? Can you imagine, man? But one I of the world's greatest assassins, warriors, and this plumber runs up on him and takes his money. He wants the coins. He just took his coins. He wants the coins. Oh, well, does that make any sense to it you? Does, it doesn't. But you know what? That's the beauty of Smash Ultimate, okay? Well, right, I think it was running around Shadow Moses. He said, where's your wallet at? Where's your wallet? Run it. Run I thought you pockets. were the janitor. Where's your wallet at? Run the pockets. Run them pockets, home. Run the pockets. I respect it, man. Mario. Wow. You know what's crazy, too? Uh, Amadeus actually played Sheik in Smash 4. Played Sheik. Mm -hmm. um, he, when we actually got here uh, Thursday, uh, we went out and got lunch. He was telling me about some of the, uh, the the pros and cons of switching off of Sheik, going to a character like Snake, like the, the similarities and, of course, the big differences. And right. I was like, okay, I'm starting to understand it. You know, obviously, the biggest thing is just you just want the ability to KO. Obviously, yeah. it's a little bit more difficult to do that with Sheik and Smash 4. You know, I mean, even post or uh, you know pre nerf uh, it didn't really matter. Um, but you know, definitely post. Um, and so, obviously, you trade a little bit of maneuverability, a little bit of evasion, just for some raw strength. As you see right here, using the grenades just to keep Mario off. Oh wait, did he oh, put absolutely. the C4 on him? Okay, no. Oh yeah, I mean, of course, you know, when you especially do those early percent combos, you yeah. know, you're not trying to get hit once and then take 80. So yes. you know what? Sometimes you just gotta Michael Bay it, right? Mm -hmm. You just gotta let it happen. That's right. Okay, he's chasing him down. And this is what, this is what could be very difficult here for Snake, man. The fact that Mark could just be so relentless, and he gets in, and he's staying in here too, man. Look at this, no grab, lets him off the hook though, just to hit him with the back here. True. Okay. Oh no, Kate. Okay. It's so hard to edge guard Snake from above sometimes, man. That cipher is just difficult, man. I'm yeah. just gonna be real. Yeah, I mean, you really want to hit him outside like that. You want to get him in a side situation in which he cannot hug the stage. Mm -hmm. When he's able to hug the stage, he's able to use that kind of cover, and it becomes exponentially higher mm -hmm. to go ahead and get a proper edge guard. So really, really good stuff there. Ooh, gets oh, gets swept gosh. up. Not yet. The DI. I if I had that up smash not connected, that down smash probably would have been enough to KO. But since True. those are like two hitboxes just combining right there, kind of sent them at a really awkward angle. 
Uh-oh. It was about to turn into doing a good job there. He knows that the up air is a really strong combo starter in Mara's arsenal. Doing his darnest right there, man, to just avoid it at all costs. Snake is oh combo food. Goodness. I love the crouch on that play. Go prone. Right. Okay, up air from above gets, oh, Tyler Perry. Perry. Tyler Perry. Another one, roll out. Okay, good. Oh, okay, yeah, some good start. footwork from the ledge right here, but he's eating a lot of feet himself. Yep. And those up airs from up underneath, yeah. man, just a thorn and snake side. Definitely a lot of feet and soul, bro. Mm. You know, them boots are dirty, too. Yep. Are you serious? Okay, forward smash and neutral. Why not, man? Send the message. Yep, coins. Not yet. It's a bully of Chuck E. Cheese. I want your coins, sir. Okay, back throw. Just set up here. Smart stuff. Going for Nikita. Now, see, originally before he was going for, like, run off Nair, like, run off order. Uh, I think he's kind of cool in his jets now. He understands that Schroeder is very well aware here in the snake matchup. Okay. A little early on the trigger there with the C4. But it's just the most sort of, like, uh, like space coverage, right? Just to make sure that he can actually own that space in that situation. Yes. Nonetheless, uh, we're going to see Schroeder go ahead and get the F-smash good stuff. Let's see Ooh. if he can get out of this like, blood okay. situation. I like that, man. All the snakes getting forward here are happy after pounds. I'm liking that. All right, let him know, man. Drop the leg on him. Yep. Okay. Utilizing that cape there. I like that. Just taking away grenades and up smash there by Snake. Oh, the Snake oh, okay. Tech. Okay. Uh-oh. Bombs away. All right, good grab. Going to oh, get that no. Nair. Opportunity here, though. Uh-oh. Thought he was actually going to cape him there that time. Let yeah. him off the hook. And again, falling down with another forward or a couple uppers. Oh, we're, we're, going up. we're going up. We're going up. We're going up. Oh, why? Not, never mind. All right. <laughs> Oh, we in playoffs, baby. We definitely in playoffs. <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> Whatever it takes. Man. Whatever it takes, man. Whatever it takes. <laughs> we should have did that to Thanos that time. We <laughs> That's what he's <laughs> Do that to Thanos. <laughs> that, and that Infinity War, bro. <laughs> that was the gauntlet for it there right there, man. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> All right. All right, I'm trying to bring it back. All right, I right. got to center my, whew, get my chi right, okay? <clears throat> got to balance myself. Right. All right. I'm about to commentate the rest. It's like Richard Lewis for some donations, okay? <laughs> Welcome back, E-League. Esports Arena. We got Bomb of the People. Rob the Dutch on the mic. Keep it locked right here. Don't touch that. That'll be right back with some more TBS E-League action coming your way. How was that? Was that pretty good? Did you like my Richard Lewis? I I'm actually tight right now. Come on. <laughs> well, now we're going to go into... <laughs> I don't want to hear anything from you. <laughs> Wait, what? 99 to 1? That's OD. What the heck? <laughs> okay. He's smothering him right now. That? Finally, we've seen a grenade. That's smart, though. Grenade, obviously, a really good get off me tactic if you have percent to spare with Snake. <laughs> what you doing? Okay. Hey, watch yourself. Ooh. Just hold him down the corner. Perry Cruz. Good oh, stuff. Why not, man? Fight for the future, baby. That's yeah, right. Okay. Wow, he's just getting so much off of these uppers. Oh, wow. Hey, all right. Man. Like I said, man. Down. It's not the All Star game. Relax. Hey. It ain't the All-Star game, but we're doing this for a good cause. Man. If you want to style on stream, go ahead and style, man. Yes, sir. Okay, gets the fall through back here. He's definitely playing like he has Amadeus' is never. Amadeus is going to have to bring something a little different to the table here right now. Yeah. Okay, University Dome, man, with that up smash. That's right, Get man. another one. The knowledge. Oh, Why wow. not? Why not? That, that was Harvard right there. That's the hard That's hat. That's an MIT graduate. That's oh, all I thought. I think he, I think he put a C4 on oh, him. Money. Oh, yeah, of course okay. he did. Slippery and sticky all at the same time, man. What's he about to do with it? Back Ooh, in. Yep, the trade. Yep. Ooh! Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. I can do that, too. Oh, man. <laughs> That's kick. Mm. Okay. One, two, three. Okay. So show him you can box up close. It's okay, Amadeus. We know there's more to you than just projectiles. Get yep. in there. Oh, oh, we start off. Oh, wait, I think he caught a bomb by mistake. I love that he went for a wave land after that combo, but still, nonetheless, he eat all that damage. All right. situation here. We're going high. Love the recovery. Mm -hmm. I like how he just floats around him, too. Man, he doesn't mind burning that, uh, that second jump. If yeah. that means that he can cross him up with relative ease. I like that, man. Good play. 
Set the ledge. Gonna get him. Gonna corner himself. Off stage situation. And see, more times than not, we see the opponent kind of, uh, you know, short hop around Snake. You expect to see up tilt immediately. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Like yeah, it's exactly. a good get off the top thing. Like you see it right there. But it almost feels like Amadeus is just a little bit more hesitant in this game on when he decides to go for up tilt. Oh, yeah. He definitely is a person that's seen thus far where he, he wants that for his kill. He wants it at the optimal time. And I respect him. Mm -hmm. okay, smart stuff right there by Shorty. Yeah, stay close while he has a grenade in hand. What's he about to do with it? Oh. Not gonna happen. Wait a minute. Oh, first hit a forward tilt, smart stuff. Didn't go for the second because he, he was trying to avoid that, but he still ended up getting thrown anyway. Yeah. And see, that's just the thing about Snake. You know, sometimes when the percents gets, uh, get a little high, uh, there's just a couple of things you just can't go for anymore, man. True. Like, you just don't have the percent to kind of burn. Absolutely. Oh, he put a sticky on that. Boom. See ya. Gone. The 50 50. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's such a good tactic, man. You know, and I'm, oh, my. Oh, did you see his face? I love these guys. <laughs> That's an Italian plumber, bro. He does not care. I love these guys. He man. had enough, man. Sometimes you got to rise above the occasion, bro. You do. You Sometimes do. Sometimes you got to rise above the occasion. You most definitely do, man. Schroeder, going to move on four. Mm -hmm. Schroeder was really – I think that was my first time commentating some Schroeder, too, man. Uh, or maybe second time. Regardless, though, for those of you guys in the chat and at home who think uh, thinks Mario's not good anymore, Mario's still very, very strong. Oh, Mario game. is, you know, I mean, very, I think, very strong. I think that was a really good showing. And then, of course, like Battle of BC was a really good showing of just showcasing how great Mario still is. Um, Shout out to my boy E-Sam, though. Yeah.